What's going on guys? Welcome back to the lifestyle. Today I'm going to be retwisting my hair. So now look, you guys get to 100% see the fresh before. Like this is it before. My hair is completely crazy right now. Um, I'm gonna be retwisting it because you know Thanksgiving coming up and I gotta retwist my hair. I'm gonna show you guys really quickly what I'm gonna be using. So my products are really simple. I have this, whoa, almost dropped it. Boom, boom, boom. I have this. What does it say? Tropical Roots Firm Locking Gel. Pineapple and Guava. It smells really good. I'll show you guys the inside because it looks pretty cool too. See, nice and pink. Um, so I'm just gonna be using that. Some little black rubber bands that I have here that are gonna go on my twist. I have clips because I might part just to make things easier for me. But um, we'll see how that goes. So I'm gonna switch my location into the bathroom and then you guys will see what I'm doing with my hair. I don't know if I'm gonna voice it over or just do it. But that's what we're about to go do. I'll see you guys there. All right, guys. So, oh my God, my hair, man. Seeing it stick up is like crazy. Yep, now I'm about to get started. I'm just gonna like section it a little bit and then I'm gonna start. But I'm gonna show you guys how you're supposed to do it and why it's so important. All right guys, so look, here's how you do it. I parted it, well not parted, but sectioned this off and this off so it's out the way. So you're gonna take every two and gonna open up your locking gel and take a little bit like literally like a little bit like a little bit on my finger just because this is more for like short dreads you know so since i'm using it for short dreads i just take it put it on one i make sure that i twist it in the direction it grows in so my hair is like this way if I go the other way, it's gonna get loose. So I do it this way. Once I get it, I gotta do the one next to it. I hold this one. Get some more gel. Put it on the next one. Now make sure your rubber bands are ready to be used. And now I'm gonna hold it like this. And here's where I start to twist them. So you have to make sure that you hold them and then you keep it tight. Now you have to make sure that you're achieving that two strand pattern look because that means you're twisting your hair but like it's in a separate way you know so hold on let me tie this one together first get the rubber band put it on the very end as tight as possible so that it doesn't come out one done okay so the reason for me twisting it the way I twist it is because since you have all these are just a single dread right and you're trying to put two together and then you're gonna unravel them later when you unravel them you want it to come out as two type of coils instead of one twist together because the wrong would look like hmm. show you what a wrong one would look like 
See, this was wrong. This is two dreads twisted together. This is what it looks like when it's wrong. This is what it looks like when it's right. This is a side-by-side -side view. Wrong one, correct one. Should look like this, not this. Because when it looks like that and you untake your dreads, it's not gonna be as formed as you want it to be because it's a retwist. So, it won't be as good. So now I'm gonna do the second one just to show you guys again. And then I'll go into time lapse and do my entire head. Hopefully I don't get tired and stop. So you always wanna make sure that you're twisting your hair in the direction that it's supposed to be going in. As you see, my hair does not go this way. Cause this way it makes it get looser. It goes this way. Put the gel on. My finger, grab the second one, and now I'll make sure I get them and go in the correct direction, keeping them tight together. Alright guys, that's how you do the twist. Now I'm going to continue with the rest of my head and I will get back to you guys when I'm done.
looks like. Let's see if I can get the back. That's what the back looks like. I needed to all lay down, so while I'm sleeping, I'm gonna put on a do rag, so called lay down. Especially in the back, because in the back it's not as laid down. But um, yeah, it's done. You know, the goal is to have your roots kind of like that. That way, you can, um, if you have your roots like this, you'll, um, when you untwist them, they'll be like nice, hard, and eventually, after doing this a couple of more times, is this camera even on me? No. After doing it a couple more times, your thing will be locked. Perfect. I'm tired. I don't even I can't even hold this camera right now. But um yeah. So I'm done. Alright guys, so I'm done. Gonna go with the cover on and I'll see you guys next time. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And um, if you're looking for more dread tutorials, let me know like what you've been looking for. Maybe I know how to do it. Maybe I can explain it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.